everybody. Welcome to this new sample modeling walkthrough video. What you heard was a live performance played using the sample modeling solo violin. Sample modeling has long been a pioneer for innovative processing techniques in the field of virtual instruments. These techniques preserve the harmonic richness of real samples while allowing the user to shape every single aspect of the sound available to the real instrument. Today we're going to talk about the solo violin, so let's jump in with the details of the instrument parameters. The starting point is undoubtedly the proper handling of velocity. Using velocity, you can vary the attack of the sound and help shape overlapped notes, which can trigger, for example, a legato, portamento, or glissando transition. The instrument will assist you with complex scripting algorithms that automatically control attack ramps, pitch, and other aspects of the sound. Let's take this section as an example and focus on the attacks. In this case, you want to reproduce a more accented initial attack. Just by playing the note a bit stronger than the medium value, you'll obtain an enhanced attack. If you keep the velocity around 64, the attack of the note will be normal. In contrast, if you want a smoother attack, you can lower the velocity of the notes. Using velocity, you can also shape the transition between overlap notes. If the notes are played at medium velocities, you'll have a natural and neutral legato transition. Values lower than 64 progressively convert legato to a portamento glissando transition. Using velocity is extremely powerful to manage the attacks in real-time performances. You can set your favorite curves in order to easily achieve the effect you want. Simply by controlling velocity, you'll have access to 127 different attacks and transitions without the need of a single key switch. Let's talk about dynamics. Sample Modeling is the first company ever to have processed real samples using advanced proprietary modeling techniques to seamlessly shape the behavior of the instruments in real time. The solo violin, like the other sample modeling instruments, has virtually infinite layers of sound. It can accurately reproduce the timbral evolution from very soft to very loud playing, modulating dynamics with continuous, stepless transitions from pianissimo to fortissimo. The goal is to provide the best in playability and realism, allowing the user to create the music they imagine, rather than working with an inflexible instrument. We highly recommend trying a MIDI controller to shape the dynamics in real time during your performance. This can include a modulation wheel, XY pad, breath controller, expression pedal, or any MIDI device that can transmit MIDI CC data. If you don't have any of these controllers, don't worry. The instrument is designed to help the user achieve a great performance, even with simple note entry using your mouse and keyboard. Vibrato is undoubtedly an essential element for expressing your musical ideas. Sample modeling uses a complex modeled vibrato. You can apply this extremely realistic vibrato and adjust its intensity with MIDI CC1. 
the algorithms will automatically manage pitch, intensity, harmonic, and timbre variation based on deep analysis of real performances. If you desire, you can manually change the vibrato rate by controlling and automating the parameter CC19. For more plug-and-play users, the instrument gives the option of exploiting an automatic vibrato. Before the performance, you may select the vibrato intensity, rate, and delay time. For those who want to manually control everything and achieve the most flexibility from the instrument, sample modeling instruments can be used without any algorithmic help at all. This allows performing your vibrato directly by changing the pitch with a controller. For example, with physical controllers like a MIDI ring, the rate and intensity of vibrato may be controlled simply by the movement of your hand in the air. Last but not least, pitch variations are essential for creating a realistic sound. Real string instruments maintain a pitch that constantly fluctuates around a precise note. The same thing happens with sample modeling instruments, whereby the algorithms introduce slight pitch variations based on the study of real models. These variations are strictly related to the performance data and can be removed or enhanced with the corresponding MIDI CC. However, there's nothing better than writing your own pitch curves directly into the piano roll or during the performance with pitch band wheels or MIDI motion controllers. In the live performance you heard, everything was controlled in real time without any post-editing of the MIDI data. But if you want meticulous editing control following your own performance, there are plenty of options available. For example, you can control bow management on the attacks to obtain spiccato or marcato articulations, overtones, bow noise, and much more. We will explore these options and more in upcoming videos. Thanks for watching and we look forward to seeing you in the next walkthrough. For more info, subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on our website and other social media. The Sample Modeling Team wishes you a great day.